السلام عليكم ورحمة الله الحمد لله رب العالمين والصلاة والسلام على أشرف المرسلين نبينا محمد وعلى آله وصحبه أجمعين We continue إن شاء الله تعالى from the book فضل الإسلام and we are um, in chapter number 10 and the title of the chapter uh, is as he says قول الله تعالى يا أهل الكتاب لما تحاجون في إبراهيم إلى قوله وما كان من المشركين so the title of the chapter is a verse uh, in surah al Imran verse number 65 all the way to 67 يا أهل الكتاب لما تحاجون في إبراهيم وما أنزلت التوراة والإنجيل إلا من بعدها فلا تعقلون ها أنتم هؤلاء حاججتم فيما لكم به علم فلما تحاجون فيما ليس لكم به علم والله يعلم وأنتم لا تعلمون ما كان إبراهيم يهوديا ولا نصرانيا ولكن كان حنيفا مسلما وما كان من المشركين which uh, basically the translation O people of the scripture why do you argue about Ibrahim while the Torah and the Injil were not revealed until after them? Then will you not reason? Here you are, those who have argued about that of which you have some knowledge, but why do you argue about that of which you have no knowledge? And Allah knows why you know not. Ibrahim السلام, was neither a Jew nor a Christian, but he was one inclining toward truth, a Muslim submitting to Allah, and he was not of the polytheists um, and the <clears throat> the objective of this chapter related to the previous one when we talked about the bid'ah and how the person upon bid'ah innovations the tawbah for him is more difficult than uh, those who commit major sins what is meant by this chapter is that the uh, what the bid'ah leads the person is to make him uh, averse or desire other than the deen of al-islam he turns away from the deen of Islam. This is what uh, the bid'ah leads the person to. And doesn't have to be for every person, but this is basically the root of it, the seed of it in the, in the heart. So the person's heart will become more and more taken other than the deen of Islam as the, the deen that to follow uh, and so on. So it's basically the, the, the trap that the shaitan makes through the bid'ah to uh, lead people astray all the way till he take them outside the fold of Islam. So he makes it, the shaitan makes it easy for the people to uh, leave the deen of Islam to be upon something else by through the, the passage of the bid'ah. And what is meant by this title of these verses, that the Jews and the Christians, when they differed among themselves, you know, uh, away from the religion of Ibrahim alayhi salam, because they changed in their religion. You know, they innovated things in their religion. They did not follow their prophets. And they went away from the way of Ibrahim alayhi salam. And the prophets that they claim that they follow, it's all because of the roots of the bid'ah or innovation in the deen. 